Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Light Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I am here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Aries who are watching. So if you have Aries as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Aries, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart, Aries, is your person. That's your person and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and officially begin and get started, please keep in mind that this is and will be a general reading for your sign, Aries, so it may or may not resonate for you here specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. Also, Aries, if you are interested in viewing your extended reading, which will be the energy that follows up with the energy of this reading, feel free to check out the Patreon membership. It'll be linked down in the comments and in the description. But without further ado, Aries, let's see what we have going on for you here. Can we please receive a couple messages from my Aries, please, when it comes to the energy of love? Let's see who this person is that Aries is dealing with or the person making their way towards Aries. And what is the energy like between Aries and this person? All right, so... Let's officially begin with what we have so far. First, we have, I want long term with you. I will prove to you through time how much I care about you. I will prove to you through time how much I care about you. I'm over dating. Show me something different. Through the darkness, we found this love, aka my light. I'm not ready to secure this. I'm not ready to secure this. And you will soon find out everything. You will soon find out everything. All right, Aries. So I feel like this is already someone you know here. And I feel like the energy is still ongoing. But I feel like <laughs> there was something that caused a misunderstanding or someone said something that they realized how they worded it or they realized what they said and that was a mistake on their end and that damaged your your belief or your optimism your faith towards this connection I feel like prior to that energy happening Aries you were freely moving in this connection you weren't concerned you were showing yourself like your your true authentic self but once this person did that action or said what they said that's when like a brick wall came came in front like a barrier just came up from the ground Aries and I, I feel like that made you think differently of them or think differently of this here so honestly Aries I feel like you may be given you may be giving this person the silent treatment or you just need time, you need space, you need silence from them. And I feel like you are making it known here to this person. You're not sugarcoating it. You're not just going to be in, your, in their face and act like everything is okay when you're holding back these feelings of whether it be sadness or anger, whatever it is, Aries. So let's just go ahead and get into these messages one by one. First, we have through the darkness, we found this love, aka my light. I do feel like this is a shared energy here. You and this person may have bond, bonded or connected over something like a, a deep experience that it comes off as it takes one to know one. Or say you and this person were both done wrong by the same person or just sharing like a a connection that you 
you and this person only only know Aries. I hope I phrase that correctly, but through the darkness we found this love, aka my light. I feel like you two were able to build this connection from I, I want to use the word disparity or it's like we're not about to let our past pain override the love that is right in front of us. And this could make you feel like there was more substance or more depth. Like it's not just an exterior physical attraction towards one another. There's something that can't be replicated. And once again, it takes one to know one. So through the darkness, we found this love, AKA my light, your energy Aries. I want long term with you. I feel like this is the energy that you wanted to show this person because you were in it to win it. You were invested in them. And you start to show them how loyal of a partner you are, Aries. And I feel like this is this person's energy too, but with whatever action or what they said to make you stray away from this, it's like, why would you say that if, if you really want long-term with me? Or why would you hurt my feelings just to make your point? Perhaps ego got in the way, Aries. We have, I'm over dating, show me something different. So I feel like this is your energy, Aries. Once again, with I want long term with you, you're not just casually dating to have superficial or temporary satisfactions or experiences. I feel like you want to plant the seed and watch it grow, watch something come out of fruition, um, reap abundance with your your partner that you attract so this also implies that you aries are not about to tolerate someone walking over your feelings and emotions someone thinking that they could get away with this and that because all of that really counts when it compiles into something long term the red flags that they show you now aries could definitely foreshadow in the future and with whatever happened aries the i'm not ready to secure this i feel like that's when you start to think about realistically, is this person going to be the person I would like for them to be, the partner I deserve and desire? Say, for example, you two were having like a, a conversation. It's, it was turning into something more. It could have been an argument, Aries, but this is just an example. Say this person was like, I'm not sure if I'm ready to just settle down with one person. I'm not ready to secure this. It's like, why Why are you with me then? Why are you professing that you want long-term with me when you're not sure if you can settle down with one person at this point in your life? So I, I feel like that was the type of energy you took away from this connection and you did not appreciate it. I will prove to you through time how much I care about you, this person's energy, Aries, because they know how you feel. You're not sugarcoating the effects of what they said and how that impacted you here. And you will soon find out everything. So I feel like this could be just a piece of the puzzle, Aries. Say that example did resonate with what is going down within this connection here. I feel as though you're seeking the truth with this person. Could be a moment of clarity, a moment of confirmation, your intuition resonating with you. You could have distanced yourself from this person, but you're still connected to them because you want for this to work. You do have those feelings of love and care for them. But if there's more to find out or if it's just one, one bad news after another bad news, it, it could be the end of it, Aries, for you. Let's see what else we have going on for Aries when it comes to this energy here. One more message here. Let's take this card, Aries. So we have a couple more messages here. Once again, Aries, if you are interested in viewing the energy that is yet to come after this energy, the extended reading will be posted down below. We have my favorite memories involve you. When I see you, I see happiness all around. 
I love you, but I refuse to settle. It's all fun and games until I'm unavailable. And I wish you'd stop playing games and love me straight up. So all in all Aries, referring back to that example, I stated that that could be a relevant energy here. I feel like it also came down to, okay, you did this or you said this and you wouldn't have did it or said it if it wasn't on your mind. Say it was even a quote unquote joke that this person said it's like every joke has a little bit of truth in it so and that's the thing Aries the person that you feel like is your soulmate or the person you think of the traits the qualities it can unfold just like that like of course mistakes do happen nothing's perfect but when it comes to hurting your feelings you don't have to you don't have to receive that or tolerate that from a lover, you know? So let's get into prior energy. My favorite memories involve you. You may have been getting to know this person for some time. And the fact that this was taking its course and you two had to reach milestones together, it could have reassured you that this is going somewhere. This is going to be my, my partner for this lifetime. When I see you, I see happiness all around. Your energy, Aries. I, and I feel like your love was definitely received. This person knew exactly how you felt about them. But it's all fun and games until I'm unavailable. Deep down, Aries, you could be sensitive. We all have feelings and emotions. We might hide them differently. We might showcase them differently. But just because you're strong and you're bold and you're courageous and people view you as that, that doesn't mean that you don't think about things that have hurt you throughout the day or in your past and you you wear it you you hide it well or you handle it well Aries but someone may have definitely crossed the line with you here and I wish you'd stop or let's get into I love you but I refuse to settle I do feel like this is your energy as well Aries this did not have to happen you would have thought twice. This wouldn't have even came into your mind if you really cared about how I would feel after the fact or even in the moment. So I feel like you're definitely choosing yourself here, Aries, and I wish you'd stop playing games with me and love me straight up. So this could have been the straw that broke the camel's back, even if it was just one time that something happened, um, especially if or not even especially if, but the fact that you've been getting to know this person over time. Have you been wasting time this whole time? And that's something that you don't even want to question, Aries. So it could be the end of it, but I do feel like this person knows where you stand moving forward and they could reach out to you. We are experiencing Mercury retrograde at this moment. As far as signs, Aries, could be dealing with another Aries here. Libra. Aries, Libra, Leo, remember Aries that extended reading will be posted in the comments in Scorpio. So Scorpio, Aries, Libra, and Leo. All right, Aries, so as always, I do appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you all next time. Bye.